amigos. Where's the sky? I am living for this coconut filter. I don't know which one of the girls found it, but hello. Um, is this working yet? Can you guys do me a favour? Can someone let me know if this connection is uh, any good? Because um, I'm outside, so it might not be the best. But the weather's so nice, so... Let me know if it's blurry or not. Oh, I can see everyone's commenting now. Hello, hello. I lost my filter. Should I leave it off? I'm gonna leave it off. Okay, good. The signal's all right. What's everybody up to? Who's excited to see the new rules, boys? I don't actually know who I'm speaking to today. So we'll see. We'll see which one it is. I don't even know if they're on here yet. They're probably not, to be honest. I was a minute early, you know. Keen. The hay fever. Like, I don't normally get hay fever, you know, but... Sorry, it's not very attractive. It's just getting to me a little bit. I'm good, thanks. How are all of you? Oh, my God, it's your birthday on Tuesday. Happy birthday. Remind us. And we'll... Are you guys having a single album soon? I don't know, to be honest. It's a bit of a difficult time to to give that kind of information. Do you know what I mean? Don't, no one really knows what's going to happen for the next... Foreseeable until all of this gets sorted out. Right. I don't know. I wonder if the boys are here yet. I don't think they are. When they get here, I'll add them. Ask, when the boys come on, ask if they're a, wait, I don't want to say that word because I don't want you, are you guys getting me in trouble? What is that? Tell me what it is and then I'll, and then I'll ask. Um, good luck if it's Nathan's wife. <laughs> oh no. Oh, there's the tree. <laughs> Sorry about that. Please ask them, well you need to tell me what it is. I'm not saying it. Imagine I get myself in trouble. I'm actually just sitting in the garden because even though it's not particularly warm right now, it's very... Um Miss out on the sun, so I'm just sitting here. I'm in a full tracksuit. Oh my gosh, you remember Drop the Lemon? I was gonna, I'm gonna say that to them. I've, I've just requested, well, I've not requested, what's it? tried to add them to the live um yeah i'm gonna take boys i know you can see me right now or whoever it is which one of you it is drop the lemon i need to get i should get a lemon out of the fridge actually i can play it virtually why won't it connect colchi is basically a farmer in ireland who lives in the countryside <laughs> come on boys let me try this again I'm trying to get it. Hey, Woo! Nathan, you okay? I'm good. How are you? You good? I'm good. Did you see everyone like slating your Wi Fi in the comments? This is literally my life. Um, yeah. People like to talk a lot of shit about my Wi Fi, but I think it's going to be okay today. This is going to be good. No, this looks good. Yours is probably better than mine right now because I'm outside. So. Well, fingers we'll crossed it stays like that. I've got to say, you, um, you look like you're having a pretty good quarantine so far. I mean. I'm not complaining right now. No, it looks sick. Where um, where actually are you? I'm in the Cotswolds. Oh, sick. Okay, that's nice. My mum lives here. Where are you? I uh, I'm with my I'm back at my parents' house in Essex. So um, I'm in Chelmsford. Oh. If you know that place. Oh yeah, but that's nice because you're a little bit like you're not in London, like slap bang in the middle of everything. No, you know what we um, so because we all live together in in um in London, and when that kind of this all kind of kicked off, we definitely didn't think it was you know no one thought it was going to be as serious as yeah, it was yeah 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 and so um we were like oh it's fine we'll just you know chill here and you know buy lots of you know pasta and stuff yeah and um and then our parents basically pretty much came and picked us up and said no you're being silly we're taking you home so uh now we're here <clears throat> but all good oh my gosh i just saw ryan said hi by the way 
Um, but no, I get you. I came to my mum's like a week before lockdown, but it like like you said, it was just before. So like no one really like people were saying, Oh, we're going to lockdown, but no one had confirmed it. And I was just coming to see my mum for four days. So I've literally got four changes of clothes <laughs> that God, I'm having yeah. to wash and wear on repeat because I didn't plan on being here for a month. Do it's you know crazy, I mean? isn't it? It's just yeah, it's it's like, you know, it's just turned into this massive, massive thing. But like I mean, hopefully you know, this won't be forever and we can get back to normal at some point. Yeah, I know. But you, I feel uh, like... Have you been able to see the girls? No, and we miss each other so much. Like, we were actually saying, I know you said you and the boys, like, live together normally. We miss living together right now because we could have been isolating together. Yeah, no. <laughs> but now we don't live together anymore. It's like, it's lovely because we get to be with our families, but it's, like, hard to... I'm sure you can relate it's hard to like make content and do everything like that when you're not together definitely like you have to be as you know like super creative in like how you're gonna like yeah. content from like being three different places don't you but um mm. I, but you know i follow you guys you, you guys have been killing it you know you guys oh have <laughs> thank you by the way i've been listening to pasta <laughs> i love it i feel like that song and i think so many girls will relate but i feel like it's me <laughs> well this is the thing Sophia it is about you I'm, I'm glad you brought it up <laughs> oh my god I feel honoured no but like it's so relatable like, even though it's you guys that are singing it like even listening to it as a girl it's like oh my love sitting with my hair tied up with a bowl of pasta like do you know what I mean Thank you. it's you know so what? good like, that song has just been a bit crazy for us I um so we wrote this song like last year and yeah We've like for any for any new rules um, kind of fam who who are, who are watching this they they know the story but we basically wrote it as a bit of a bit of a joke it was kind of like this is a bit of fun you know all she wants was a bowl of pasta yeah and then like our management heard it and just like loved it and we were like thought they were joking <clears throat> and um you know we played it on tour and just like saw such an amazing reaction that we knew we had to release it and it's been pretty amazing seeing how everyone's been you know kind of like reacting to it so far. Yeah, it's so good. It it doesn't like it doesn't sound like gimmicky. It's just a it's like a great song and it's relatable, but it's a bit fun as well, which is nice. Thank you. I'm glad you like it. I love it. it. I love it. I was listening to it and I was like, <laughs> I played it the other day and I had my hair tied up and I was sat on the sofa and I was like, <laughs> boys. <laughs> <laughs> no, I'm joking. But um, but yeah, what have you been doing to keep yourself busy? You know what? We've actually been. Um, pretty busy all of us we've kind of just been <clears throat> using the time to um do loads of writing which has been good um and then kind of just like you know how like social media can just like take up your day like you'll sit down on instagram and then before you know it it's like eight o'clock and it's yeah. time to go to bed you know have a cup of tea mm -hmm. um it's a full-time job in itself it's mad it's crazy but um we love it so so it's all good and tiktok obviously as well which you know i've seen you guys are on are on tiktok <laughs> But I swear, one of one of I our first ones you on was with you. Yeah, no, yeah, I remember that. That was um, that was in Sheffield, right? Yeah, the big gig. Someone actually mentioned it when I was trying to connect with you, and they were like, "Oh, you don't drop the lemon." And I remember you guys were in our dressing room, and you were like, "Do you want to do this TikTok with us? We've got this lemon, and we want to play this game." We were like, "Oh my god, okay." See, it was so funny. That. I remember that, and um, like, don't drop the lemon had been like a game for a little while before that, but we were like. We were trying to get people involved at the time, and we were like, obviously, we just... No, we'd met you guys before. Have we met you guys before? I think I'm... Okay, if, I, if this is wrong, then it would be really bad, but I swear that was the first time we properly met. No, it probably was, wasn't it? It was the first time. I think time. it was, yeah, yeah, yeah. Wait, when was... um? We met you guys at um, GAY in Manchester. Was that before or after? GAY in Manchester? Do you remember? Did you do... Wait, did, you did do... GAY. Oh, yeah, the Pride. Yeah. That was it. <clears throat> oh my gosh no that was before you're right you're right you're right that was before um it's just called pride isn't it i just that's my yeah yeah, yeah. It. no but it, it's, uh, it's gay pride so yeah i mean that was i think that was the first time but like we only met for a second didn't we yeah um, that was I, i'm struggling to actually remember that that's really bad but i remember we had loads of fun at the big gig like we were just like being absolute goons backstage i'm pretty sure we were pissing everybody else off um <laughs> We were, do you That's remember okay. the security guard when we tried to throw the lemon at him and he was just like not having it? He was just like... Um, yeah, you know what? Fun story about that. We then went back to that arena. Um, it'll probably be like three weeks after that. And he was there again. And um, 
he brought up Don't Drop the Lemon and actually was really into it. He w he's like, and we didn't have any lemons, so we couldn't play with him. But, you know, oh we my changed God. him, I guess. So he must have enjoyed it then. I think he just had like a bit of a front up. I think he was thinking, you know, why are these weird, weird people throwing lemons at me? Which is a very good question. <laughs> I think everyone thought that. The Raksu boys were there as well, weren't they? And we did it with them. They caught it, though. They did. Well, they were good at it, which was irritating because we're actually very bad at it. <laughs> Oh my gosh, we need to do, do you know when we went on stage after we played that, we were talking about it on stage and I remember just, we were all like gassing about it on stage and I remember thinking, why are we talking about this, a, a lemon on stage, like what, <laughs> what are we doing? It's, um, yeah, it's, I mean it's completely ridiculous, um, <clears throat> you probably wouldn't have seen this, but, so um, right before like all this kind of shitstorm quarantine thing started happening, yeah. um, we, we were on our own tour and we we actually made like a lemon that you could buy for merch, like a like a stress ball one. No, you didn't. And um, yeah, we did. We we committed to the joke, and they, they like went. They like sold out every night. It's crazy. Um, Are you joking? So like I want lemon. one. Have you got any left? I'm sure we. Yeah, I'm sure we can find some. Jim, our merch. Oh my gosh! Can we have some you want lemons? <laughs> yeah, I'll send, I'll send you guys some. <laughs> I actually love that. It can be our thing. Like whenever. Like, uh, that is literally what I associate with you guys now. So if ever, if we get hold of one of these lemons and we play that game, it's going to be like, oh my God, new rules, new rules, new rules. It's ridiculous, <laughs> but you know, it's a bit fun. It's a great, it's a great little thing to associate yourselves with. Um, yeah, strong, br strong brand, eh? Strong brand. <laughs> <laughs> um, have you, um, you guys got a, a new song coming at all? Have you guys been working on any music? We, we well, well, well. I've heard St Superstar, by the way, which is sick. Do you like it? it? Really like it. It's oh, really good. thank you. Um, I I know I always get really nervous when people ask about new music because I always feel like I'm going to put my foot in it. But um, we've we've just before like all of this, we shot a video for the next single, which is probably my favourite video we've done, and it's yeah. it's really exciting. So that's coming soon soon are, are your fans the same do you guys hate the word soon because i swear every time i say it, I, I, i'm about to get shot i have learned to stop saying soon for exactly yeah that um, um no but i get it soon i get it yeah yeah soon so that's, well, that's sick okay um i'm just exciting. glad that we did the video just before because like everything's basically pretty much ready it just do you know what i mean it would be a bit more daunting if we didn't know like if we had nothing ready I know it's crazy, and like seeing like a lot of um, kind of like bands or artists in a situation exactly like that with, yeah. like, you know, who were uh, who don't don't have like a huge amount of like material to mm. get out now, mm. and obviously none of us know how long this is going to be before. So like it's proper scary for like it really you know, for is. Everything. Even if you do have that kind of shit, like we had, um, so we had pasta, um, and that came out like five days into quarantine, and then we had the video already already done. So it's the same as you guys in the way that we kind of had a bit of content. Yeah. Um, but other than that, like, we've got the next single lined up, which, you know, thank, thank heavens for that. But, yeah. Um, When's that coming? Yeah, have you announced that yet? Or is that... We haven't, haven't announced a date yet, so... Okay. Soon. <laughs> soon? <laughs> soon. All I'm seeing in the comments is, soon, oh my God, soon means that five months, soon. Uh, I like, know, um, I know. It's so funny. But no, that's really good. Like, that's good that you've got something lined up because it's, it is a bit of a... But I've seen... Do you know what I really love? I've seen so many, like, lovely comments about the music industry and, like, um, actors and basically just creatives that are, like, um, like PTs, people that do fitness, like, all of these, like, creatives that are putting things out there for everyone to keep them busy. Like, it's so true. Like, obviously primarily it's the front line and the key workers that we need to be grateful to because they're just amazing but yes. it's so nice to see that like appreciation like I would be so bored if there wasn't these like fitness people doing their workouts and like singers doing their live concerts so it's really nice to see no, that it's um it's amazing you're, you're exactly right like it's kind of it's so funny that like at the same time the whole world like everybody is in the same situation so mm -hmm. <clears throat> it's kind of in a funny way, like, obviously, I've seen a lot of people talking about this, but it's kind of, like, nice that everyone's kind of coming together in a funny way. You know? 100%. Like, I don't yeah, feel like be... the world will be the same for a while after this. Like, people will, like, 
it might eventually go back to how it was before which is fine but I feel like for a while it will be everyone will be a lot more accepting like it's forcing everyone to be equal like you said like there's no like tears like everyone is on the same level everyone's experiencing the same thing everyone's going through it together 100% yeah I mean I think I think you're probably right like the cynic in me says that you know like give it a month of being back to normal and everyone would be back to being like the kind of narcissistic mm. like you know dickhead that we all are um but that's fine you know but um no it's oh, what's just kind of landed on me Nathan? Ah. <laughs> I'll show it it's on my arm it's on my arm I don't know what to do <laughs> okay you need to be complete Sophia oh you, yeah you need to I'm be completely here. chill it's gone oh my god sorry I completely cut you off <laughs> no, that's fine um, I'm actually not afraid of wasps. I'm one of the only few people who can be calm in the situation. So you're lucky you're on the line with me just then. Are you joking me? I, to be honest, since I've been here, I've got better because they're everywhere. But I don't mind bees because they're less likely to sting you. But wasps, I'm just like, what is the point? I don't, actually don't understand. <clears throat> I, yeah, I mean, wasps are like, they're like dips, aren't they? Because like, <laughs> if a bee stings you, he dies. And he also spends his whole day just going around and like pollinating plants and stuff. Yeah, so a wasp it's like doesn't yeah. do anything nice. Honestly, a wasp literally just goes around stinging people for the fun of it. I hate it. Someone just said they want a motivational speech from you. Go on, give us your best one. No, can't do it. Come on, can't do come it. on. We all need a bit of motivation <laughs> right now. Um, we're all gonna be okay. We're all in this together. Um. Yeah, keep keep your head up. Keep your head up, oh, people. There you go, guys. You, go. you can screen good, record right? that bit. <laughs> <laughs> I love it. What are your plans this evening, then? Like, not that there's much to do, but, you know. This is the thing, like, any kind of, like, friends who, like, are messaging at the moment, like, it's very much like, oh, cool, what are you up to? It's like, yeah, I know exactly what you're up to because you're, you're just at home, just doing your own thing. Mm -hmm. I would probably watch a bit of Netflix. And, um, yeah, what about you? um well we've got a dog so we would probably take him for our daily walk in like when i come off the phone to you and nice. then just watch watch them well, we've, we've been cooking quite a lot just because it's kills time um nice. and then we'll watch something i've been watching the nest with my mum have you have you seen it you know what my parents are like hooked on that um, it's so good yeah like everyone is saying how good it is i'm gonna i'm gonna watch it but i don't know if you're you're like me in this like I kind of need a season to be finished before I can start watching it because when I start, I just want to keep going. I know what you mean. And also, I feel like if you get into something, like watching it online when it's still going on TV, like for me, that just doesn't feel right. I have to, if I've missed the start on TV, I have to wait till it's finished on TV yeah, and then yeah. I'll start. Like, yeah, I'm but saying, gotta wait. my mum was watching it and I was like, oh, what is this? Like, I wasn't really paying attention. I was just on my phone or whatever. And then I was just like, that's how you know it's good because it got me hooked and I wasn't even paying attention. That like, is one of them. Anything that like gets gets my eyes off of my phone screen for a bit, it's got to be good. <laughs> yeah, know? I feel like I'm I'm I haven't even looked at my screen time on my phone. I don't think I want to. It's going to be appalling. <clears throat> I don't dare do it, honestly. Like, it, well, especially during during this, like, it's just too tempting just to be looking at it the whole day, isn't it? Especially yeah. when like there's a lot of stuff you can be doing, as you know, obviously being in a band yourself. There's mm. always stuff you can be doing. So, yeah, I'm the same. Always looking at the screen. I've got an idea. I feel like we should... I don't know how to do it because I've never done it before, but we should do a duet on TikTok. Totally. How, do I don't know how, so you might. I might have to message you and um, you, you can guys, let me know. But... Okay, well, you just, you just put yourself in it here because... Um, <laughs> do you guys want to do you guys wanna do our pasta TikTok challenge? Yes, yes. What is it? Can you show me it now? Uh, um, not really. Here's the thing. It's a bit tricky. Um... Okay. The, the idea is like, okay, so you know what the song's about? It's all about kind of like accepting kind of like um, your insecurities and kind yeah. of like being very confident and all that. Mm -hmm. So it's like you're all dressed up and you've got like makeup on and then you're like, screw it. You take off your makeup and you get into your, your sweatpants and you just kind of like sit down with like some Doritos or some shit. Oh my God, I love that. Yes, a hundred percent. Okay, so, so we'll what, do if you it. guys we'll do, do that, it. I'll, after this, I'll send you like an example if you guys want to do it. And then... Um, We'll, we'll do it with you and we'll put on our Okay, on our cool. And you can do Superstar too. Loz just said that. Yeah. You can do Superstar too. This is sick. Look at this. It's like... Cinema. Have you guys... Look. Can I make a request? You're probably not going to say yes to this. But if you do the Superstar one, as is like the opposite yeah. of yours, so you start like bummy and then yeah. you like turn into like a glam version of yourself. 
like a glow up. You guys should dress up in dresses. Like you actually should. <clears throat> we um yes, I mean look, we can we can one hundred percent do that. But the thing is, we kind of did this last week with um with our own life. We you know we've been doing this um, new rules and friends thing, which you guys should, okay. should join sometime. Yeah. And, um, and Alec basically challenged me and Ryan to dress up as um, Little Mix from one of their videos. That is genius. Which video did you do? I chose, shout out to my ex, and then Ryan chose, I think it was Woman Like Me. Oh, and um, Ryan, Ryan's watching this. I've just seen his watching this. He was <laughs> like bizarrely accurate. It was really, really good. Um, but yes, we can totally do that. Just send me a, Oh send my God, that would be, that w I need to see that. But yeah, that would be amazing because it's like, and oh, there's three of you and four of us. I bet you had the same problem with Little Mix, but you can, that's just, yeah. That's genius, actually. Because you yeah, went on I mean, tour with them, didn't you? We did, yeah, yeah. They're, um, How was they're that? Legends. It was like proper crazy. Um, it was like 30, 30 dates um, around the UK and, and Ireland um, yeah. in the arenas. And we'd never played venues that size before. Um, yeah. And also just like kind of hanging around them, like they're so cool. They're really, you know, they're just like, they've been doing it for a long time and they're really good at it. So mm. to be able to like be a part of that process and see how they do it, it was just really, really cool. <laughs> to be honest, I'm quite jealous because whenever we've met them, they've just been so lovely. And obviously they're like massive idols for us because they are where we ideally want to be at some point. Um, so I've, I'm jealous of you, to be quite honest. <laughs> Um, well, yeah, as you know, they're so cool. And yeah, I can't wait for Four of Diamonds to be doing that same thing. Uh, oh. Yeah, it's going to be sick. <laughs> and you guys, we'll have to like, oh, I don't know, we should do one big super group performance one day. That could, that could be fun. <laughs> that could be Imagine. really pretty fun. But you know what it could be? The twist could be that like we dress up as you and you dress up as us. Oh my then, gosh. Um, this is epic. You this, know. this would be like <laughs> iconic. It's coming together, this plan. We'll talk this through. We can get this better. Yeah, we'll sort like this out. Right. Yeah. Oh, my gosh. I can't believe what's come of this live. Like, we just started talking about normal stuff and we've ended up promising each other we'd dress up as each other. Wow. You should have, you should have expected this when you agreed to go live with New Rules. Um, <laughs> I love it. You guys are so fun. Like, the fact that you've got a song out called Pasta is just the best thing in the world. Like, the lyrics are amazing. And then you've just promised to basically dress up as us for a TikTok. I mean, what more there's, could you want? literally nothing we won't do for clout, honestly, at this point. <laughs> like, we're just, we're desperate. <laughs> Wait, that, that is just relatable, isn't it? Legends. I love nice that. One. Well, thank you so much for joining me. Um, I'll yeah, well, thank you very much for quarantine evening and um yeah i'm gonna have to can, we'll sort out this duet thing um and we'll we'll do them hit us up in the dms yeah we'll we'll get together we'll work it out i will good luck with Great. the single and i'm sure we'll talk to you soon thank you very much enjoy walking the dog we'll speak later thank you bye bye, bye everyone. <laughs> oh my gosh i was so trying to how sweet is Nathan by the way I was trying to read these comments and I couldn't because they were going so quick so I'm gonna have to watch the live back and read all the comments but thank you everybody for tuning in um you guys are the sweetest and we'll have to do this again because you guys are the best all right then have a lovely evening and see you soon bye <laughs>